address us to the fall of the ice industry? I mean, do you think that 2026, 2027, the big players for GM will just collapse because they just can't come up with EVs fast enough? I think that um, I think that my prediction initially was 2030 for 50-50. Okay, the tipping point for um, EVs and ICE vehicles was supposed to be then. I moved it up a bit to 2028. I think that uh, there will be survivors, uh, but they'll be a whole lot smaller. Um, I think that Ford will survive. I think that Volkswagen and GM, if they survive, will be a shadow of their former self, and they're going to have to divest. Uh, a whole lot uh, in a hurry. Um, I don't know what those characters are going to do, but uh, they're in deep trouble. Uh, you saw what happened to Fiat. They've fallen off the table. Nobody wants them. Um, Stellantis, the new company, which is Fiat and PSA, um, I believe that um, they're going to need money. And uh, they, they need money. They're going to have to sell something off. And the something they're going to probably sell off is uh, Chrysler uh, Dodge Jeep. Uh, and when they sell that off, I'll buy stock. And then I'll, I'll buy enough stock that I, uh, I, I, I will have a, a word. Uh, I will have a word on their board or something. I want, I'd like to see Chrysler survive, and it will never survive under Stellantis. Never. None of these clowns are going to get out of their own way, let alone uh, be able to dominate the marketplace in the future. So you're going to see a lot of names that you used to know. Um, uh, get a whole lot smaller. Toyota, Honda, uh, oh, <laughs> I forgot, the shining star. Hyundai and Kia, who'd have guessed? Who'd have guessed that those guys are now in second place? Are now in second place. Uh, it's not my first microphone. So, <laughs> you know, who would have, have guessed that they were in second place uh, as, far as, uh, as far as selling product? And, and, and having customer acceptance. They, I mean, it's just, this is an amazing time. Like I said, big names that used to be in the, uh, in the 1800s, the 1890s and whatnot, they vanished completely um, when, when 1910 showed up. It's amazing we're in that exact same situation. We're, we're gonna see a lot of um, giants fall and a lot of, um, a lot of midgets suddenly become 18 feet tall. There, there's a lot of big changes that are gonna happen.